Osteoarthritis is a degenerative disease affecting synovial joints. It is the most common form of arthritis and is responsible for a significant decline in quality of life of patients. Clinically, the disease is characterized by joint pain, limitation of movement, tenderness and local inflammation. The disease affects not only the cartilage, but the entire joint, including the subchondral bone, the synovial membrane, the capsule, and the periarticular muscles. Interleukin-1, or IL-1, plays a crucial role in triggering the cascade of reactions, leading to cartilage breakdown, joint inflammation, and subchondral bone remodeling. In OA, the balance of new bone formation by osteoblasts and resorption by osteoclasts is altered. IL-1 stimulates the bone resorption and inhibits the bone formation. This leads to progressive degradation of the bone matrix and bone remodeling. In the cartilage, excessive production and activity of IL-1 induces chondrocytes to produce catabolic factors such as more IL-1 and other cytokines, nitric oxide and matrix metalloproteases. IL-1 also down-regulates the anabolic processes with a decrease in production of TGF-beta, collagen-2, and proteoglycans. This results in progressive cartilage breakdown. There is an increase in the number of IL-1 receptors on the surface of chondrocytes, and the increased levels of NO decrease the concentration of IL-1-RA the natural inhibitor of IL-1 receptor binding. Once IL-1 binds to its receptor, it stimulates the activation of downstream signaling pathways into the cell. The MEK-ERK signaling pathway is triggered, resulting in phosphorylation and degradation of I-kappa B and release of active NF-kappa B, which translocates into the nucleus, binds to DNA, and stimulates expression of genes involved in inflammation and cartilage catabolism. This results in production of factors perpetuating the disease process, such as cytokines, NO, and MMPs. Pro-IL-1 is cleaved by the interleukin-1 converting enzyme, ICE, to release active IL-1 into the extracellular matrix. NO is a powerful inducer of the immune response by stimulating inflammatory cell migration. This leads to further release of IL-1 by macrophages, inducing the production of inflammatory mediators and thus leading to cell damage. Through induction of NO, IL-1 indirectly stimulates chondrocyte apoptosis. The excessive production and activity of IL-1 results in further degradation of cartilage, downregulation of anabolic pathways, and inflammation of the joint. Therefore, IL-1 is a promising target to treat osteoarthritis. A drug that could reduce the elevated level of IL-1 in an OA joint could potentially restore joint homeostasis. Diacerin has a unique mode of action by inhibiting the production and activity of IL-1. Diacerin provides symptomatic relief and has disease-modifying effects. Following oral administration, diacerin is absorbed and rapidly deacetylated into its active metabolite, RAIN, which is distributed to all tissues. Diacerin reduces the number of IL-1 receptors on the surface of the chondrocytes, and through decreased production of NO, diacerin indirectly increases the concentration of IL-1-RA. The net effect is a decrease in receptor binding by IL-1. Inside the chondrocyte, diacerin inhibits the degradation of I-kappa B into NF-kappa B and its translocation into the nucleus. This reduces IL-1-induced expression of catabolic factors such as cytokines, NO, and MMPs. 
Diacerin reduces the production of ice in cartilage, leading to a reduction in the activation of IL-1. The reduced production of NO leads to a reduced activation of the immune response. As a result, diacerin also prevents NO-mediated chondrocyte apoptosis and MMP activation, which reduces the extent of cartilage damage. Diacerin also has anabolic properties. By stimulating TGF beta production, it triggers proliferation of chondrocytes and consequently increases synthesis of collagen type 2 and proteoglycans. By reducing production of IL-1, diacerin also reduces the subchondral bone remodeling. Through inhibition of production and activity of IL-1 and the subsequent effects, diacerin reduces inflammation, subchondral bone remodeling and degradation of the cartilage. The net effect is a significant slowing of disease progression and improvement in symptoms. Diacerin is a specific inhibitor of IL-1 designed for the treatment of osteoarthritis. By its unique mode of action, diacerin provides symptomatic relief with beneficial disease-modifying effects. <laughs>